Hey guys, welcome back. We're playing Interstellar Marine for today with the update 216, which includes the new campaign mission, Star Crown, as well as some additions to our profile here under statistics, where they finally started working on a little bit of the uh, uh, stat tracking. So it looks like it records mostly all the stuff that you can do within the game, like how many shots you take, how many shots you give out, how many kills, how many wins, how many losses, and favorite weapons, that sort of, that sort of thing. And as well as improved AI and I think they fixed the hitboxes in certain places. So without further ado, let's start Assault on Star Crown Aerospace. Mission update. Star Crown Aerospace is ITO's largest supplier of space avionics and research. In preparation for their next project, we've been assigned to test the security of Star Crown's main research and development facility. Infiltrate the compound, locate the vault inside the research laboratory, and download the schematics of the Altier program. Game on. Okay. Let's go, uh, hunt them down, I guess. I have not played this map yet, so this is pretty much the first run on easy. Satellite so imaging have highlighted four potential infiltration zones. Sweep and observe the exterior compound to locate the nearest access point. Combat training robots have been programmed to protect the area. Eliminate CTRs as necessary to infiltrate the facility undetected. So yeah, this is the first time I'm going to play this, so hopefully we can get through a lot before we get shot up. Looks like that hangar there looks like a good entrance, but kinda wanna infiltrate on that bridge there. Okay, let's go for the bridge. Hopefully they don't they can't see in the dark. That's one thing I'm hoping for. I have to admit, I like the environment a little bit. It's a little bit different from um, from having a training facility above our heads. But uh, from what we know from last time, this could all be just another training facility. Of course, we have our suppressor on, or silencer, whatever you want to call it. But uh, I like to call it, oh shit. Looks like there's two guards guarding the gate there. It looks like the switch for the door is right there. Not too sure if we should wait for them or... Yeah, we should wait for them. Ooh. Too bad we can't just climb in from like a sewage duct or something like that. Kind of like the reverse of Shawshank. Alright, I think best idea now is just to wait out and then uh, attack the front guards. One down. I know there's another one. Come on, where are you? So in all likelihood, up. There we go. Still kind of uh, working on the full auto since there's no single, there's no single shot just yet. Oh, I oh, almost had him. Almost had him. Just don't move. Don't move. Don't you dare fucking move. Oh, you son of a bitch! Stop moving. I'm gonna get him once he comes back. Oh, beauty. Still working with the taser rounds, it looks like. So, hopefully. Uh, 
Let's do a full sweep just to make sure. I know we're not on a time limit, but uh, in a way I am kind of working on a time limit based on the size of my hard drive and all that. I did get something a little interesting on the weekend. I finally bought Space Engineers, which was on sale for, I think, 11 bucks. And I'm not too sure if I should really do some Let's Plays on it, because it feels like it's pretty, whoa. Like it's a grind fest when it comes to uh, building things and doing things in the game at the moment. I'm not too sure. Maybe uh, leave a comment. Let me know if you want me to do Space Engineers. Oh, I hit him. I fucking hit him. Achievement unlocked. Oh, yeah. You rank. Okay, I might like this entrance here. Since, there's, since it seems like it's one way in and one way out. I might be able to do this. I have to admit the facility I love. What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Shut up! You didn't see anything. All you saw was a tree. Lights out, bitch. As from what I can tell from the uh, server browser for Interstellar Marines, they still have not fixed the server issues. Like, North American servers are still laggy and I keep getting timed out on them compared to the uh, Compared to the uh, European servers, which I somehow can connect, but they're fucking laggy as hell. our way up here. It looks pretty safe. So let's try and uh, get inside here. Let's begin our infill. Wrong button. Everything looks good so far. So far we only took out, what, three guys? Just only three guys? Just to make sure they're not like standing on the watchtower there. I'm assuming there's a way to drop down from up top from here. If not, this could be a little awkward. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Alright. Try going through the hallway of death. So far, I have to admit, this mission hasn't been very laggy. Unlike uh, Neurogen. But I could be wrong. Oh. 
Oh, oh, oh. I got your buddy. And I got you. So far, so good. Made it into the lobby. That's all that matters. Looks like that door's locked. That door's locked. I don't like this. Actually, let's, let's turn that off. Okay, it looks like this area overlooks the uh, courtyard here. This. this key card gives you access to the officer's building. Officer's building. Actually, there we go. I want to see what's going on inside. Looks really quiet. Be a good thing, could be a bad thing. Let's keep moving to Alpha. Oh shit. What the fuck was that? Oh, it's an elevator. Oh, I don't like this at all. Holy shit. Okay. So far, so good. Haven't gotten shot at yet, that's for sure. Large facility. A viable tactic is to divide your team to cover more areas. Alright, let's try. Let's try a stealthy approach here. Pretty much I'm gonna shoot up the lights and make an approach. I don't like this one bit. I really don't like this one bit. The gate to the main research building is controlled from the security building at the center of the facility. The security building is of restricted access. Secure a key card from the officer's building. Did you know, I already get the key card? Like I've already walked in here, I don't know how I'm gonna get inside. Oh shit. Where did he come from?
Alright, that is not a good place. I think I should, uh... I think I should fall back. Just in case that happens again. What I can do is try and walk the catwalk, I guess. Probably some way I can get up there. Okay, let's try the elevator again, maybe. Maybe we'll have more luck. Nope. Okay. <laughs> So that's not the way to go, that's for sure. Now yeah, well, I'm a little confused. Okay. What if we go down here? And just to be sure, it's out. So we're taking a pretty long route around this, I guess. I'm not too sure exactly where we're supposed to go. But hopefully, it'll take us to uh, where we need to go. More of more of his friends there. Definitely one more. You saw nothing. Guessing this is the way in. I think I'm gonna go through the guard shack first. Oh, I hear breathing. I hear robotic breathing. Shoot up the lights here. It does seem like there's a way up up through the actual door outside. So that's the objective that we're going to. And I 
think we're right under the uh, right under the objective here. I have to admit, this game is very very stealth based. Well, this campaign mission, anyways. The other one, not so much. Oh, in the neck. Another one in the neck. I swear I hear one breathing, but I'm not too sure where he is. And that's what scares me, because I don't know where he is. It's kind of scary. You can still hear that breathing, like, if you can't hear it, I can definitely hear it. He's somewhere. The problem is, I don't know where. Some of these buttons don't work. the outside. Looks like a uh, landing bay of some kind. I guess there's a way where we have to extract here. So I think we're in a place that we're not supposed to be. Um. Yep. Looks like we made a little detour. <laughs> 